A small museum in South Omaha is connecting cultures. Lindsay is live at 25th and L. That's right. Well, from the dances that take place on this stage to folk music concerts, it's all going on here at El Museo Latino, and it's about connecting cultures from Latin America, which is Mexico, South and Central America. Take a look. On the corner of South 25th and L Streets, a hidden gem of South Omaha sits. It's deeply rooted in the culture of the community. El Museo Latino is one of only 17 Latino museums in the United States. But they use it for the cactus fibers, which is a huge um, source of work. We got a tour from the museo's Magdalena Garcia. She founded this museum in 1993. At the time, it was the first Latino art and history museum and cultural center in the Midwest. I'm originally from Mexico City, but having grown up here, the little community was growing, not doesn't compare to Texas and California, but it was a growing community also. And something needed to happen. There was nothing in the Midwest, and why not Omaha? Inside, an art gallery features the works of Ignacio Rivero, a photographer whose pieces reflect his home, the Yucatan Coast. They're helping local artists too with a residency program. Made it called out for a local artist, did the application, then a panel then selected the three that are working. So for the first time we have Low, we're trying to, you know, support more our local Latino artists and kind of a springboard to, you know, help with their, get their work out. The idea behind Museo Latino is simple. Have a museum that offers not only exhibits, but programs, and not just for Latinos, but for everyone, so people can learn about the culture from Mexico, South, and Central America. Thank you for being here. Inside today, they're also helping teachers from Omaha Public Schools meet. Since 1993, multiculturalism has been a curriculum mandate in the state of Nebraska. It starts here with strolling through the gallery, but includes classes and workshops in art, dance, and music. Altogether, it's complementing a passion for a growing culture. And back out here live. So while they have been around since 1993, they're continuing to add programs, that local residency program that you just heard about. And then here's a really cool one that starts tomorrow. Every third Thursday of the month, they are opening up the galleries for free, 6 to 9 p.m. And to tomorrow night is no exception. In addition to getting in here for free, they will have live Latin music. Can't wait to check that one out. We are live in South Omaha. I'll send it back to you guys. All right, Lindsay. Thank